this is CNET, and here are the stories that matter right now. Samsung is ready to share what went wrong with the Galaxy Note 7. For several months, Samsung and other independent organizations have investigated why the phone was prone to catching fire. The company will share its findings through a press conference in South Korea on Monday, which ends up being 8 p.m. Sunday night on the East Coast for those in the U.S. It will be live streamed on Samsung.com. The company may pin the blame on poorly made batteries. At least that's according to a Wall Street Journal report citing unnamed sources. The hot new anime photo makeover app MeToo has been criticized for a suspicious code that collects unnecessary data of its users, including access to location, phone number, and the ability to automatically run its startup. The Chinese app maker defends that it is not selling personal user data and blames the dodgy looking data collection on restrictions from China. The app's makers created workarounds to collect user data in different ways, and the data is said to be protected with multi-layer encryption. Amazon has created virtual versions of its Dash buttons, so instead of physical buttons scattered around your home to instantly reorder items, now you can click on images of the buttons on the homepage. It's designed for frequently purchased household products. Stay up to date with the latest by downloading the CNET Tech Today app in the Apple App Store.